Troy from uh, Armadillo Custom Line Campus at the Victorian Caravan Camping and Touring Super Show. Right. Try and get that out in one mouthful, <laughs> Troy. No, you have a turn now, mate. See if you can get it all out. <laughs> yeah, no, no, you're right. You've got a dome pat. Yeah, laughing. Troy, you've got the rigs here yes. uh, over the weekend. Are you pretty excited about that? Yeah, we're waiting for the crowd to race in and uh, yeah, have a look over our vans and yeah, put it on show. And yeah, it's a well, good, good way to. To sort of get the brand out there. Yeah, it is. While you've got the stage, tell everyone that's listening a bit about the uh, Armadillo line. Well, we've got five in our range. Uh, we start off with the, the top of the range is the Armadillo. A new release this weekend at the Super Show. It's a new a, release for the sh Super Show? Yes. Well, yep. tell us about that. Well, it's an Armadillo that our previous trail was like, yep. but even better. We've got a walk up in the front now, so you can walk up and step into the bed. And that's all fully automated, so it's got a remote control step that folds down, so yep. you can walk up beside the bed. All right, so if people are walking around and they hear Armadillo campers, what are some of the characteristics um, that set Armadillo ap apart? Well, ours are in enclosed trailer, so we've got compartments around the side. Uh, you'll, you'll notice our trailers because they've got checker plate doors, so they, they stand, a, stand out from the rest For of them. For a camper trailer... The checker plate stuff is critical, isn't it? Yes. Because yeah. you're generally off road, you're roughing it a bit more, so that that robustness is critical. Oh, it is, yes, yes, and it just makes our camper trailer look different to everybody else's. Uh, when you see one of our trailers drive past, you'll you'll you know it. spot it straight away. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Uh, and tell us where are they made, where are they produced. Our factory's up on at Yatler on the Gold Coast. Beautiful. Um, we make everything in the house ourselves. So uh, you know the steel's Australian. We're part of the Camper Trailer Manufacturers Guild. Yep. Uh, every two years we get ordered to buy an independent engineer. Yes. So what people are buying is what they're, you know, they're seeing. That's great peace of mind. Yeah. Now, whereabouts are you here in the showgrounds? We are, oh, you got me there. Where is it? Right up in the middle, um, number 89. Side there eight. you go, up in the middle, number side 89. 80, <laughs> side 89, yeah. If you can get there, <laughs> I'd love to see you. That's right, yeah. Um, so, Troy, have a great weekend. Thank you, Terry. But yep. um, you've got Sue yes. standing here. She's not wearing an Armadillo Custom Line T-shirt. She's got the Stephen Walter Children's Cancer Foundation um, T-shirt on. Yeah. Sue, what's Sue doing here? Well, Sue is a, a, an ambassador and uh, founder, founder of a, a very good cause that looks after kids with cancer. And I'll... Let's so you guys support the cause? We do, yes. We've donated a camper trailer to raffle off. To, okay. Yeah, put towards them. Well, let's find out a little bit more about the foundation. Sue, tell us a bit about the Stephen Walter Children's Cancer Foundation. Yep. Well, Stephen Walter Children's Cancer Foundation actually started as a request from my son, Stephen, who died from childhood cancer. He was 11 when he was diagnosed and unfortunately he died when he was 19. Yeah. And he left a request for us to raise money for research so that one day no other child would have to go through what he'd been through. A child, to have that maturity... I know, it's incredible. Um, at that age, to look beyond himself... It's amazing. That must never... That mm. That's amazing. It is, absolutely So amazing. touching and it inspiring. Is. must have been inspiring. Yeah, it was. And we started out just doing one event to raise money and it was so successful that we thought, oh, well, maybe we should do it again. And now here we are 15 years down the track, right. still raising money. And we've donated in excess of $6 million towards research for childhood cancer. Okay. Mm. And to have Troy and the team at Armadillo supporting you and in partnership is great. Fantastic. Um, tell us a little bit about the... The partnership here this weekend? Well, we're here this weekend. Troy and Maz from Armadillo Custom Line Campers have donated a camper trailer and we're actually selling raffle tickets. Oh, Five dollars a ticket. Stop the press. <laughs> Stay that again. What's, what's, someone's giving away something? Yep, absolutely. They're giving away. <laughs> <laughs> They've donated yeah. it to us to raise money. So it's $5 a ticket. You can actually buy a ticket here. We're on the stand with Maz and Troy at Custom Line Armadillo Campers. Or you can go online to our website and buy tickets. Where's the website? Which is stephenwalterfoundation.org.au. Okay, great. Yep. So what's the value of this camper? 22000 22 grand. Mm. Armadillo Custom Line Camper could be yours for a cheeky $5 ticket, which is going to an amazing cause. Absolutely. And every... Yeah, Isn't that's it? right. It is a win-win. And every $5 goes to research. So we have a lot of volunteers that help us. Yeah. And um, there's no all of the money that's raised goes towards the research projects. Two yep, tickets. There you go. 
<laughs> two tickets. This is we'll legitimate. Let's get this. Two tickets. I want them. Yeah. Make sure don't you come back. Because I know where you are. 85. 89. 89. 89. 89. There you go. See, I don't know, but I'm glad you do. I'm glad you do. So I've got two tickets. Yeah. And it's okay if I win. Is it okay Absolutely. if I win? George, yeah. is it okay? Of course it is. Yes. Yeah, of course it is. Jim? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> well, um, how many years have you been giving away the camper for? This is the second year. Okay. So we actually met Maz and Troy coincidentally. They were looking for a charity to support, a, ch- a children's charity. And we had a, um, a charity motorcycle ride that we were running a r- ride around Australia and bumped into these guys. They were heading to a show in Darwin. Yes. And in the middle of um, Queensland at Camerwheel, at a roadside stop, Troy bumped into one of our riders. They started chatting. And before we knew it, they donated a camper trailer to us. So oh. that's how the relationship started. What a great start. Mm. It was funny because Sue and Alan had, had come back and they told them that we were donating a trailer. And Sue and I all thought, oh, what are we going to do with a trailer? Yeah. <laughs> Little knowing that it's a uh, camper trailer. We're going to lug, gonna lug some bricks yeah, around. Yeah, yeah. yeah, hot water service and you know, battery <laughs> yeah. and stove and stuff. Yeah. So that was a quite funny what when they come and surprise. meet us first time. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think it's fantastic for everyone who's walking around the showgrounds over the next three or four days, looking for their next caravan, camper, whatever they're looking for, yeah. to know that one... They can give to a fantastic cause, and we do need to address cancer. Absolutely, and we cancer do. in our kids. Well, there's 500 children are diagnosed with cancer every year in Australia, and 150 of them don't survive. So that's three children a week are losing their lives to cancer yeah. every week. That's not good enough. No, it's not Let's good enough. Let's do what we can. Yep. You're doing a very honourable thing in continuing to pursue that, Sue. Yes. And I think we have an opportunity this weekend to help that by donating, and possibly, well. I don't know if people are going to win because I've just bought the winning tickets, haven't I? <laughs> right, oh well, it's donation, Give the tickets then, anyway. It's Give the t- buy the tickets anyway. Um, if you want to find out more about the camper trailers, what's the website, Troy? Uh, Armadillo Custom Line. Yeah. Dot com dot au. Dot com dot au. Armadillo Custom Line. Dot com dot au. And to find out about the foundation, Sue. Stephen Walter Foundation dot org dot au. All right. If you see these guys around the grounds, say hello to them over the next couple of days. All the best. Thanks for your time, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. What's up down under?